Okay, one, two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two, three. Do you read me? I read you. Yeah, I read one, you. One, two, three, four, yeah. It yeah. works better one. On? There we go. <laughs> okay. Information, Papa, 2253 Zulu weather, wind 2807, visibility 10, sky clear, temperature 22, 2.12, altimeter 29, 9 or 2, ILS runway 2-8 right approach in use, land party runway 2-8 right and runway 2-8 left. Nose Airman, has this weather information for the Southern California area, available on high-loss, flight or flight service frequencies. I advise such contact, give information, Papa. You want to give it a break check real quick? Yeah. And I'll give mine a break check. A little bit of power. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. Ground good afternoon, Skyhook number 49022 Delta. At Gibbs with information, Papa, eastbound departure request. 49022 Delta, Montgomery Ground, runway 28 right, taxi via Juliet Hotel Alpha. 28 right, taxiing via Juliet Hotel and Alpha 22 Delta. Okay, good. All right. We're clear on the right. Comes clear on the left as well. Clear on the left as well. Very good. Taking a left turn. Okay. Very good. So it's yeah. decreasing once. Two. Left. It's clear on the right. Correct. Uh -huh. on the right. Left as well. And the right right is on the right. So it's increasing. One, two, ball on left. The turn Very on the good. right. And Very the horizon is steady. Very good. So good afternoon, it's Skyhawk number 49022 Delta is ready, holding point Alpha 28 right, right on wing departure. 49022 Delta, Montgomery Tower, make a right down with departure, runway 28 right, clear for takeoff, traffic 2 mile final. We are clear for takeoff 28 right, 22 Delta, right on wing departure. Okay, now start coming back with your wheel. And uh, we have out a delay because there's a traffic on final. Yep. So you keep it rolling your wheels all the way back. Pretend we're rolling in mud. There's a lot of soft field out there. If you slow up, you could bog down into the mud. Well, clear. Power back just slightly as you push in on the rudder. No brake, just push in on the rudder. Got a little bit of power. Good roll in there. You go. Again, nice and easy. Start applying power. Be ready to start releasing some of the back pressure as the nose comes up. Yeah. There you go, right about there. Full power. Bit straight. It'll raise. It'll come off the ground by itself. You'll feel it. Just two from one down, I'm not coming. Hey, I will release, now, now, release the back pressure. Level it out, level it out, level it out. There you go. Once you get to about, that's good. Good job. Yeah. Before the number. Yeah, you can. Traffic San Diego East, uh, uh, brown and white Cessna 172 at 3,500 feet, just to the west of Lake Jennings, heading eastbound. Okay, you know what we're going to do is we're going to stay on our pr present heading. We're going to head out to that little valley there. But on okay. our way there, we're going to do some maneuvers. So once we get a little bit out of this area, a little bit more, I'll have you do some clearing turns. And then we'll go into uh, a steep turn, one to the left, one to the right. Just 30 taking 30-degree bank and 90-degree change in direction. We bring it around to maybe west. We'll keep our eye open for the traffic. I'm looking around here to the right, too. I don't see anybody. Try to hang on to 4,500 feet while you're doing a turn. And that's good. Come on back to the right. We're clear on the right. Watch your altitude. Try to keep it, keep it about 45. Yeah. Okay, another 30 degree bank. To the right. To it's the right. on the right. Yeah, we're going to go all the way around to the right. You can check under your wing there. I cleared you already when you were coming around. Hey, we look good. So you pick a reference point wherever you want to start it at. 27 on ending at north. Then okay. You got your heading bug on there. Very good. 4,500. We got about 80, 85 knots. It looks good. You make a 360 yeah, degree yeah. turn okay. to the right and another 360 yeah. degree okay. to the left. Sorry. With about a 45 degree bank north. between the 30 oh. and the... Yeah, Ooh, yeah, 60. Okay. It's clear on the right. Okay. Remember, just take a nice yeah, level 30 north, degree uh, bank. Cherokee, 43248. It's about uh, four miles after... You hey, watch your climbing. Airport, Don't pitch up so much right around. You only got 30 degrees of bank. Uh, you try a level point. turn. Then start going steeper as you go to 45 degree bank. Then start pitching up. Then check your altimeter and check your vertical speed to see if that's a good uh, pitch attitude. Use the rower rivets. That rower rivet should be somewhere around the horizon. 
can make about a 45 degree cut with the cowl against the horizon. There you go. That's good. That's good, Vince. Power looks good. Yeah, your speed's around 80, 85. Good. Once you get about 20 degrees prior to your yeah, reference point, start to roll out. And roll out to the left now. Continue your turn. Nice level turn. First 30 degrees. Then keep going to 45 degrees and start pitching up. Here's a little trim if you want. Two whips of the trim wheel. Oh, maybe. There you go. It makes it a little easy. Good, good job, good job. Great. Excellent, excellent. Then I'll go uh, northeast. Just like you say, it's mostly an outside maneuver you're checking outside. Uh, you start losing altitude, shallow the bank uh, about 5 degrees, readjust the pitch. Great. Very well done. Okay, good. Pass that one. <laughs> Alright. Next one. Next one we'll do will be slow flight. Okay. And the way we'll do this is we're going to eventually have full flaps. We're going to keep it at 4,500 feet. We're going to get about 50 knots out of it. Don't rush it. Take your time so, with uh, it. So, I time out at least. First thing I do, then lower the flaps for it. You can bring your power back to about 1700. Carburetor heat. Let's go ahead and make a turn to the right to a heading about uh, 300. Only give me about a... No, to the right? right? No, to the left. Sorry. And only give me about 10 degrees of bank. 10 degrees and Hold 300 it. to the left. Hold it about uh, 6 knots. 10 or 20 degrees of bank maximum. No more than that. Good. Now, let's go ahead and put some more flaps down. Let's go to 50 knot. Sorry, 50? 50, 5, zero. Okay. And remember, power is altitude, pitch is airspeed. All right, the next one we're going to do, we're going to get ready to do some uh, power off stalls. Okay. So if you give me another turn, check under your wing real quick. Let's get the airplane slowed up to about 80 knots. Put your new turning. We'll, we'll bring it all the way around to a heading of about two one zero. Two two zero. Great reach rail stall. <laughs> Here it comes. Our back pressure not be embarrassed. Okay, there it goes. I'll release the back pressure and give it full power. I'll reach for your flaps, bring them up to 20, start your climb out. Now you're out of trouble, see? When we get there, what we're going to do, I'm going to do, do a little uh, unusual attitude hood work with you, but I also want to do a couple of stalls. One will be, again, the uh, power off stall. Anyway, here, I'll demonstrate to you. So, while I'm slowing it up, I'm going to look for a little bit of traffic. I'm going to make some clearing turns while I'm doing this. Off to the left. Any airplane slowing up at the same time. I'm in a white arc, I'll put one notch of flaps as I get a little closer to that white arc. Come back to the right, buddy around. Flaps come down 10 degrees. Pull the airplane up a bit. And flaps another 10 degrees, 20 degrees of flaps. And I pretend my runway is out here, just okay. ahead of me. I want to get full, full flaps, flaps at 30, let's go to 40. I'm going to set up about 500 feet per minute at 65 knots. There I go. There's my 500 feet. Right. Okay. okay, there's my 65. I'll raise the nose. Now, I want to use the trim to help me up here. I want just to hold this attitude right about here because and the power is all the way off. I want to try to, what I call, stretch the glide. I'm trying to make that airport a little bit free. Put some right runner in to keep the heading. Keeping it coming back. Keeping it coming back. Keeping it coming back. Keeping it coming back. Well, it finally stalls. Release the back pressure carburetor heat. Take 20 degrees of flaps out. And let's start climbing. Okay. I gotta get rid of, the, get rid of some of that trip. Okay, now I can take another 10 off. Now I'm in good shape. I'm climbing at about 60. Let's go. And we're climbing. We're climbing. That's the idea. Okay, now first thing you want to do is Slow it up without climbing to about 65 knots. So if we put the power back to about 1800 with carburetor heat, and we start increasing the pitch to about right where the top of the hills are, right about there. As soon as the airspeed hits 65, come in with about uh, 2200 RPM. 
And don't forget to feed in that right runner. Okay, let's come in with the power. Everything straight, let's come in with the power. Increase the power to about 2200. 2200. Keep the pitch attitude coming up. Keep feeding in right rudder so you don't get off your heading. Keep your wings level too, don't let the no wings drop off. You're not putting enough back pressure in. You're not backing in. There you go, you got a pitch up. You got This is a higher pitch up than the other one, much higher. Leave your power at 2200, please. Carburetor heat in too. Oh, okay, now, now I'll pitch up. Pitch it up. You're climbing out, and all of a sudden somebody disturbs you and says, Vincent, look for the other airplane. You're still pitching up, and you're trying to find the other airplane, not watching what's going on. Have to okay. you're, right you're hooker, that wing. Bring that oh, wing yeah. up a little bit. You're Keep right. on that heading. Okay. Keep on that heading. Keep bringing it up. Don't right take hooker. too much time, because it can get away on you. Okay, see the airplane? Yeah, that's it. Keep it straight. Keep it coming up. Keep it coming up like this. Keep it coming up. Oh, that way. <laughs> right, right, feather. Okay, there you go. Drop it. There you go. Got a little oh, airplane there. Go ahead and descend. There's a dirt strip right off yeah, the right that shoulder. Yeah, so that we were. With X's on both right sides. Right across here. Hey, you just lost the engine. Okay. Now you can gauge it. Are we too high? Or are we too low? What do you think? Using flaps. Oh yeah. I would put them all the way down. We'll do a go around this time, gently, but I want to see see how close we can come. Oh, you're looking good. You're looking good. You can make that thing real easy. Okay, and now remember, the door is cracked open. We're ready to land. That's a better landing. And when you turn final, take it around. We'll go around now. No? Let's go around, yeah. Uh, oh, I gotta do some quick work with you first, and then we'll give... We'll go into my, my Romana for some landings. There you go. You can put it on, and oh. I got the airplane. The airplane. Okay, now all I got... I got the airplane. I want you to kind of look down at your lap. When I say to look up, then go to your instruments and recover. Okay. Okay, your airplane? I plane. Down. Don't worry about straightening the wings. Let me show you something. Keep looking I at got the, the airplane again. Okay. Look at my... Closing my eyes. Okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, your airplane. Yep. Bring the power in, straighten the wings out, and then bring it up. Just the opposite, okay. Yeah, there is one still idea, there, but... Okay, I got the airplane a minute. Go ahead. Okay, your airplane. The plane. There you go, there you go. Good, good. Oh, not that fast. Good, you did good, you did good. You brought the nose down, and you straightened the wings. You brought the nose down with power. That's good. That's the main object right there. Down. Uh, while it's coming down, give me a turn back around to 210. Nice little about a 10, 15 uh, degree bank. Good, right about there. How easy it is, how nice it is. Very good. Good control, good controllability. Once you get to 210, you can take the hood off and that won't come We're uh, flying southbound, doing basic instrument maneuvers. Setting and release. San Diego Northeast, uh, Cessna, brown and white at uh, 4,000, going down to 3,500 over the dirt strip north of Ramona, heading back to Ramona for landings. Okay, you can take the hood off now. Oh. I got the airplane. Okay. Good, 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 good. Oh. Good job, good job. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> pretty well. So go ahead, Vincent, take it down to 35. Ramona Towers, Kyok number uh, 49022 Delta, north of the field for five miles for patent training.
757 Charlie Delta, remote tower southbound class Delta transition approved altimeter. Too high, get it close to the head. Just report over there. I don't acknowledge this transmission. Drop on. Cessna 712, the top of your traffic defaults at your 12 o'clock for a mile 2400. TT Delta, your number 5, follow the Cessna oh. off your correction off the Cherokee off your left wing on downwind. Runway 27 cleared, touch and go in 260 at 10. Right, you understand 22 Delta number 5, we're calling that Cherokee off our left wing. 22 Delta, air speed. Okay, now start reducing power very slowly, but leave a little on. Don't take all the power off. A little on, get a little closer. Okay. Now, now take all the power off. Pull the airplane off. So you're not coming in close enough. That's the problem. That's right. I'll do a stop. Three quarters Lots of a up. mile. A little bit lower. Lower. A little bit lower. <laughs> oh, that's going to be three points. All the way off. Okay, flap slip. Aerodynamic braking. And we go for the brake. One two Bravo traffic ahead. Two, you left the Cessna train final for the parallel. <laughs> won't do that. I won't do that. I won't try to expedite cross 2 left without delay, kind of ground. Expediting across 2 left will contact ground, 2-2 two, two Delta. Once you're above, would you like a right 360 back to final? <laughs> That's perfect.